CCTV Camera World is proud to provide support for products purchased from our website. If you purchased your product from another vendor, please contact the vendor you purchased from for further assistance. To set up your security camera system, the first thing you need to do is connect your NVR to power, an HDMI monitor, or a VGA monitor, and then connect it to your router. You want to connect your NVR for internet access to the main router on your internet connection. On the right hand side, I have my ASUS router and it has two different kinds of ports. The four yellow ports are the local network ports. I'm going to be connecting the NVR to that. The blue port where there's a yellow cable coming out of is actually my internet port. It's called a WAN port that connects to the internet from my ISP. You may have a router that's similar to this or a router modem combination provided to you by your ISP that looks a slightly different. Just look for grouped ports that are grouped together and be sure to plug it into one of the first three ports because there's always a chance the fourth port may be a backup WAN port. So again, plug it into the, the first three ports. Now I'm going to connect my NVR to my router. My router, like I said, has LAN ports on it. All four of them happen to be yellow on mine and all four of them are, are local ports. So I've connected a cable. The red cable from there is going to go into the network port on the back of my NVR. The NVR has two kinds of ports here. This is a LAN port. This is where I'm going to connect this cable coming from the router. These are PoE ports. This is where cameras will connect. When I take a good known network cable coming from my router and connect it into my NVR, it will actually light up the status lights on the back here. Here's a zoomed in view of the network port. Again, these are PoE ports. And this is a network port. And as you can see, it is lit up. The amber light is lit up and also the green. So that tells me my NVR is actually receiving a data signal from my router. Here is a close up view of my router. As you can see, it has several lights lit up in the front. Yours should have similar status lights on there. This connection is lit up in the front LED here. Once I remove the cable, that line, light turns off. It tells me that the router, that port on there, is communicating to my NVR correctly. The wire is good and I've got a good connection there. Now we just need to follow the rest of the videos to connect our recorder to the internet. We've established a hardwired connection. If you have the lights lighting up on the back of the NVR and on your router, then you've got a good hardwired connection. Now it's important that you connect your NVR to the main router on your network, the first router slash modem. If you don't do that, the NVR or DVR that you have will not connect to the internet. Or if you have other switches and they're not properly configured, it also may not talk to the internet preventing you from being able to connect to the NVR with your phone, especially when you're away. Thanks for watching. If you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.